Kenny, when you make an entrance like this, what type of statement does that make about how you want to play this season and how you're attacking training camp? Wait, am I joining in here too? Yeah, come on. <laughs> Let's do it. All right, go. But what statement is it? Yeah. Um, it's, it's, it's nothing different from, you know, pulling up in my own car. Um, I'm ready to go. I'm ready to play ball. I'm, re I'm ready to win. How did this come about? What was the idea? How did this all come together? Oh, I, I guess mutual ties. I mean, we both have ties to, you know, Lucas Oil and their product. So um, I'm ready to get back in Lucas Oil Stadium. But uh, and they're a sponsor for for he and Arrow McLaren. So um, small we've world. Couple, we've won small a couple world. times this year. Now it's your turn. Yeah, it is. Yeah. It is to win a lot. So um, it's great to have him here. One more for me. We know this defense likes to play fast. What did you learn from spending some time this offseason around IndyCar to implement and how you guys want to play, how fast you want to be this season? On it's YouTube? crazy, so go crazy. Uh, this guy's ninja, so um, I got to play like, you know, what he what he means to IndyCar, um, and I'm ready. What is the ride like sitting in the back of the PCA? Uh, very uncomfortable, but you got to get comfortable Explain being away. Explain how rough that was. <laughs> you can feel every, every bump, um, and it's not great on the asphalt. Or, or, or rocks, but um, shoot, we here, we made it here, thankfully. Kenny, Adam, what you Adam, how fast did you get this thing going? Not very fast. Uh, maybe, I don't even think I got it up to uh, to pit lane speed limit. <laughs> <laughs> to maybe me, 40 did. miles an hour. To me, you did. Where'd you guys start this? Where'd you get the car? Where did it happen? Um, a few lots over. Okay. A few lots over. I think it was lot A, I you believe. Would let you, I mean, surely you're. You're bigger than him. Why don't you drive a car? I told him let me drive it. I didn't say no. He said I got to get on the simulator first, so that's cool. I no, I told him he had to get on the simulator <laughs> and then actually drive the real Indy car. Kenny, you've been around Indy car a lot this offseason, it seems like. What do you love about it? The speed, the adrenaline that I have, you know, before a race, I feel like I'm ready to put my own helmet on and, and play ball. So, um, and pretty much the relationships around uh, IMS, um, as well as the drivers. It's pretty good being a friend of Apato's and, and watching him compete at a high level um, and just watching good races. Do you watch him compete anything you try to take into your own game? Oh, that's a great question. Uh, not that I thought of. Full send, bro. But, uh, you know, just competing at a high level and uh, whether he thinks he himself is doing good or, or not, you know, he still competes and, you know, maybe he pulls out a victory, maybe he, he just gets points that, that, that race, but um, just keep comp competing, and you never know the outcome. Kenny, you've been around a long, a long time right now. What's, what's, the, what's it take to get you guys to the next step as a team? Uh, just t coming together and take advantage of practice because that's where we're going to put everything together to, to correlate to the field on Sunday. So um, the things that we do in the shadows that will come to light. Very few players on this team have been to the Super Bowl. Does that matter, or is it something that you can build toward regardless? No, nah, each year is different. Uh, we got our own goals, and, um, you know, we just got to put it together right now today. And, you know, whenever we, you know, play the Seahawks in September, um, you will see everything that we've, you know, inst instilled. You talking about your own goals, one of your goals? Oh, individually or a team? Oh, I, I, I feel like, for me, individually, I like to hold those personally because I can stay on myself. I don't like when, um, I just feel like God's plan is, is, you know, what he has for me, it is for me. So um, I like to hold that with myself and my family. But um, as a team, you always want to win the Super Bowl. So in order for us to do that, step one is winning the division. And we got to, you know, like I said, take care of practice in order for us to go, you know, to Tennessee week three to, you know, get it done then. But even before that, we got to take care of practice each day. Um, and then week one is, is the most important game. Realistic goal? Super Bowl realistic? Why not, I guess, is a question. What is it? Is that a realistic goal, Super Bowl? Everybody says that when they go Super Bowl? Through. Yeah, I mean, and any team in this league wants to win the Super Bowl. That's what we're all talking about during this time. So, um, But it's taking care of the little things. Yes, sir. Hey, hey, I, I have um, to ask, are you, are you vaccinated? I am. I am. Why did you feel that was important? It was a personal choice, personal choice with, um, with myself. Um, it took me a while to, you know, come to grips of, of what I wanted and what I wanted to, you know, feel around other people. So, um, yes, sir, I am. Kenny, with the with Frank out, it's, the COVID situation is very real with this team. Where, from the players you've talked to, where's the vibe at right now with you guys? I mean, have the productive, have the talks been productive? Have there been 
Um, it's a personal choice. So, like, if, if I was to talk to anybody else, you know, amongst the, the organization, you know, I'm, I'm not pushy. I'm not telling them to do anything. You know, they're, they're grown-ups, too. The way they care themselves throughout their lives, away from the building, you know, with their family, it's all on them. So, you know, we all have a decision to make at, at the end of the day. And, um, you know, whatever choice that you make, right or left, um, it's nothing's wrong about it. Hey, can last last can question. How, how, how would it be not having Frank? practices first couple of days well Frank will still be around with with zoom calls and, and still being in the team meeting so um, I don't see any uh, hinder itself uh, within the team so um, you know we will miss him uh, he's our head honcho but you know you know like if it was a player of myself you know it's the next man up so um, whoever will step in his role they'll step into it and we'll keep making the steps going forward